Hello everyone and welcome to Decay. I played this on the Xbox, I think in 2014. One of my first videos on this channel. And... Well... No. 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 Stop being such a pussy! I didn't get very far, but I found it on Steam. And I was like, I've got to give it another go now that I've actually got a pair of balls. So, let's go. I remember this being terrifying, but I... I think, looking back, it wasn't as bad as I thought it was. I was just, it was the atmosphere. So we're gonna give it a big go. You know, I find it weird. There's a, I searched for psychological horror games on Steam. And Monopoly came up. Reaching Dreams, the institution where I'm at right now. I came here to change my life. No more drugs. No more misery, nutshell. But during the first night, the first night, something happened. Dreams and hallucinations. They all feel so real at this place. I think something is trying to harm me. While someone is seeking my help. Who are you? Where are you? I feel you nearby, watching me. Are you in pain? No. I can't trust you, I'm not even sure I can trust myself. It would be easier to give up, but we're not going to do that. End it all, but we're not going to do that. And release the pain, but we're not going to do that. Click on navigation icon at the bottom to turn around. Okay. It's locked. Okay. The question mark icon will give you a hint. Okay. You need to search more in this room. Thank you. <laughs> There's nothing in here. Okie dokie. Plate and cup. <gasps> Pills. Oh, so I'll just take my medicine before I went to bed. Take your medicine! What? Oh, for his acting. What the what was in those pills? I'm not scared yet, so that's a good sign. Or a bad sign, however you wanna you wanna take it. Oh, it's unlocked now. Okay. Okay. What, why am I, why, just go back to bed, dude. Go back to bed. There's nothing that you want in here. You don't, go back to bed. You're just high. I don't like that face. I do not like that face. No offense to your face, sir, but I don't like it. It's locked. So we have to go in the authorised personnel area. But I didn't see anything. Oh. There's magnifying glasses that appear for a second and they go again. But yeah, there's nothing I can... Have a look. Oh. Oh, thank you. <laughs> thank you for the hint. Let's crawl under there. Yes. Um. No. But yes, at the same time. But also... The time is an illusion. You could argue that. You know, everyone's free to their own beliefs. Yes, I can read. Uh, hello? What the fuck? What the fuck was that? What the f Okay. There's blood on the lo That's nice. Okay, I didn't think it was going to kick in this quick. It's definitely different to the one I played. Back on the Xbox Indie Marketplace six years ago, I should hope. Okay. Let's turn the... Okay, I'm guessing I've got, I've got to find a code then. Wait, can I use the handle? Just electrocute myself and end it? No, okay. Good, because that's not what we want to do, you know. Fear is what helps us to grow. It's a fan? There is something close to the fan. Okay. Can I... I can't do anything. Okay. Let's leave this room. And let's... Oh, there's some stairs. Okay. Into the basement we go. There's a vent. There's a note. It's a drawing. Let's pick it up. This icon will appear. Click on the inventory. Okay. Examine. 
The youth is crying. Yenobs is here. Oh, the moon is burning. Love is penetrated. The men are watching. Thank you. I'm 14 and this is deep. It's too dark. No way am I crawling in there. Okay. Thank you. I'm actually... Part of me is glad that you said that. But part of me also just wants to get the heck out of here. Wait, what the? You saw that. You saw that. Who's there? I heard that. That was a door opening behind me. I heard the door open behind me. Okay, I did see before I went in there that there was a list on the wall. A bloody list. A list of names. My name is at the bottom. Pick it up. Let's have a look at the inventory. Examine. So our name is Sam Efeyev. Nicholas Johnson. Jerome Williams. Robert Harris. Joseph Collins. Wow. All these people have such generic last names. Except for us. Combine it with that. Nope, okay. Oh, I don't know what to do, what do we do? Oh, I didn't see that door, thank you. Okay, I don't like that at all. Wait, no! That is not on. That is not... Okay, at least it's hallucinations, I guess. No, door, don't open in real life. Don't do that to me. Not again. Okay. Maybe that's triggered something out here? Oh, what's this? It's a bunny rabbit, a teddy bear. Okay. Oh, there's this area too. Bricks. Wow. So awesome. I love bricks. I think that might be it for this room now. Jump scare when we go out. No? Hello? This atmosphere is awesome. Okay, now I need to turn around again. And go into here now. Okay. I don't like this place though. Wait, I've not been here either. I'm getting really confused with where I've been. A weapon. Yes. I will take it. Another ring. Don't blink. Please don't blink again. There's a red circle and a blue circle so far. Okay. That's fine. Less rooms to explore. Butterfly. It is, but I can't... Why is it stuck on a door? It symbolises something. That is red. That is what we need the red ring for. Okay, look at me. Maths and that. What the... Okay, it's a head. I thought it was a dead body. Don't move. Please don't move. Thank you. Tori was here. Yeah, the Tories are still here <laughs> when I'm playing this. I am I'm not a Tory. Tory. Okay, it wants us to do something in this room. I need to search more in this room. Oh, I don't like that at all. Okay, we, we check that out. We know that Tory was here. You know, David Cameron's hiding somewhere. Please don't jump out at me, Dave. You know, I know I didn't vote for you, but that's, you know, it's got to be this. I've just got to keep looking at him, don't I? Until he turns his head. Oh, what the? The heck? Oh! Left, right, left, left. Right. Left, right, left, left, right. What room was it? Was it, it wasn't this room, was it? Of a dog's head, what? 
<laughs> okay. Left, right, left, left, right. Left, right, left, left, right. Oh. Hello. Got a key. With a dog's head on it, I think. Yeah, it's got a doggy head, which means this goes to the dog door. Look at me, I am solving some of the clues myself. I love the hint system, it's so awesome because I'm so on edge. It's helping me a lot. I'm very grateful. Nope, that's it. That's the wrong one again. Yes! Oh, see, I'm smart. What the? Who are you? Okay, stop winking at me, please. I don't like the winking. Oh, a penny. What about this wall? We've not looked at this wall very much. Oh. Okay, I can pick up one of the photos. What could I use that picture for? And that coin. I've got no hints. Ah! What the fuck? No, no, no. What the fuck? I guess that means I've made progress. What now? This way again? I'm not scared. You're totally the one that's scared, not me. Why is this guy after me when he locked me in here in the first place? Like, why are you trying to get to me? When you were right behind me. Oh, I can turn it over. Yes. Jenny was tired of the city life. She decided to fulfill her dream. Live alone in a house in the woods, outside of town. You made that sound so bad. After a few weeks, she truly understood how much she loved it. She had found a place where she would grow old. Or so she thought. One night, before going to sleep, Jenny noticed something strange outside the house. It was difficult to see because it was so dark, but when she turned on the lamps in the room, she could clearly see a man standing next to the shed in the uncut grass. It was almost like he was observing her, nine meters from the house. Even though he terrified her, she decided to confront him, but once she was outside, man was gone. She naturally assumed that he'd ended up there by chance and disappeared immediately as soon as he saw that someone was in the house. A few days later, Jenny had already forgotten about the man. In the evening, Jenny heated up some milk. Drinking warm milk made her sleep better. She walked around the house and took small sips of the hot milk. She stopped at one of the windows and froze when she saw the man again. He stood about six meters from the house. This time, she could clearly see him. He was pale and skinny. His eyes reminded her of a doll's. The empty eyes looked at her, but at the same time, they didn't. She was about to open the window when he suddenly began walking out of her sight towards the entrance of the house. She ran quickly to the kitchen and picked up a knife. She stood there, frozen, waiting for the man. But he never came. A few minutes later, she went out to check if he was still there. He wasn't. Time went by, and once again, Jenny started to forget about the man. But on this night, it felt strange somehow. Almost as if she was being watched. Despite this incredibly unpleasant feeling, Jenny decided to try and get some much needed sleep. As she was turning off the lamps in the house, she noticed something in the corner of her eye. Something that's not usually there. It was the man. One meter from the window. 
Jenny was so scared that she screamed out loud, then she ran and hid in the bedroom. She heard his footsteps through the grass outside the house. It sounded like he was moving closer to the entrance. Jenny remembered the second time she had seen him, when he also walked towards the entrance, but then disappeared of his own free will. The thought calmed her until she heard the door slam open. As she screamed, she realised she had nothing she could defend herself with. She turned around and opened the window, jumped out and ran towards her car that was parked five metres from the house. She was trembling with fear when she started the car. As she drove away, she looked into the rearview mirror. The man was standing at the window, looking right at her. Okay. Cool. Now I'm terrified. <laughs> oh my. Oh. <sighs> I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. I just know I'm very scared. Oh, but your big balls need to search more in this room. There's still something close to the fan. There's still a door. And there's still this generator. But let me guess, I need the clue. Yes. And I know what the clue is. Yes! It's the story. Jenny was tired of the city life. So it's... Nine. It's nine meters. Then it goes to six. And then it goes to one. And then the car's five away. And it's five on the bottom of the page. So nine. Six. One. Five. See? Big brain. I did that all by myself as well. And now we got a, a piece of paper from that. Oh, it's over this way. Okay. It looks like a, a piece of paper with blood on it. Oh, why did we want? Why did we want that? Why did we want that? I didn't want it. A blood. <laughs> oh, okay. And now I'll go to the door. With the bloodstained handle. And I don't know where that is. Is it this one? Yes. Okay. Don't know why I'm excited. <laughs> oh, right. Okay. That's... That's cool. There's a... Oh! A metal block and I can combine it with the sledgehammer handle. Yes. Thank you. Now what? Now at least I have a weapon. It's a sledgehammer. It's not... <laughs> no. It's not the best weapon I could have. I don't want to find you. I want you to leave me the flip alone. Maybe if we go O in the oh, that'll be in the uh, in the vents, I think. In here, but we're still. What the? Yes. Can I go in here now, please? Do I have any lights? Well, I have a picture of Jenny. Oh, yes, of course. Sledgehammer, break through the wall. I would be done without these hints, you know. Then I can get a torch and go in the vents. And then I follow those directions. Oh, another, oh, more directions. Okay. 
So that's two sets of directions I've got now. I'm close, Sam, waiting. Oh. Okay, we're all good. We're all good. This is a lot longer than I wanted to play this for. I'll be honest, I want for 20 minutes. Played past 5 or 10. I've got to be on like 40 minutes by now. It's my lunch time. Through here. Um. Thank you, Mr. Butterfly. Okay. Okay, we'll meet again. Who are you? Your new best friend. I don't like that. What the? F okay. Um. <laughs> no, I'm not going to end it. I'm going to try and finish the episode. Don't know what what's next. Um, well, I've got our directions, which I can't use yet. I still have a sledgehammer, but okay, through here, through the basement. Okay. through here. Oh, is this door open now? Right, okay. Oh, of course. Okay, I get it. I get it. So. Up, left, left, up. Up. Left. Oh no, okay, I get it, I get it. Forward, right, right, right. So left. Forwards. Right. Right. <clears throat> right. Forward, left, left, forwards. So I kind of had the right idea the first time, but yeah. Um, no, thank you. I don't, I don't like this. There's a flower and a heart and a coin. And an open window. And I don't want there to be a man standing at the window. Time is an illusion. You've said this before, mate. Yes. Okay, what was the point of this then? Okay, there's some drawings of flowers. Yeah, we'll pick them up. The so one's got raindrops, one's got an arrow, one's got fire, one's got an eye. Okay, so completely transparent with you. Transparent? Transparent with you. I've just taken a quite a bit of a break. Um, just due to time, I've not been able to do everything I've wanted to do. However, now, we're here, and we're not far away from finishing the episode. So, we're going to do it. So, I'm pretty sure, and I won't pretend that I haven't, because it is because I want to see how much we have left. We use this now. 
So, these sentences all link to the flowers, yeah? Yeah, you see? So, one of the flowers has a teardrop on, crying. One has flames on, burning. One is penetrated, arrow. And the other one has an eye, watching. So, this wall has lots of, oh, it has a man on it. So I, I guess that means that, uh, yes, I know this puzzle, but I don't know anything else that's gonna happen. So this one would have the, the men are watching. Okay. Oh, see, I've just been editing the first part of this and I feel like a complete wet wipe playing this being scared, but the atmosphere I don't know if it comes across on video, but the atmosphere is incredible. I would have the lights on. Oh! Whoa, what the? Okay. I'd like to have the lights off now, but obviously I've not got the right lighting um, set up for that, so you wouldn't be able to see me. But oh, oh man, this is this is rough. This is really. Oh, no, that's right, I'm I'm a big boy. You don't get scared of video games, you know. You do that when you're like 14 like I used to, you know, but I'm, I'm coming on 20, you know. You don't scream at games. So in here now, we got blue. Uh, so this one would be fire. Because the youth is burning. And it's like a desk. No, we've got, we've got the, um... No, wait, hold on, that's wrong, that's wrong, that's wrong. No, wait, that's right, sorry, that's right. <laughs> I'm being confused, yeah. So that's burning because it's got the moonlight. And the moon is burning. Don't know where my brain was before. Now I need to go back to the room with all the eyes in. I'm not too sure where that was. That wasn't this way, was it? No. So I need to go this way. And through here. If you want to play this game, it's so cheap, I recommend it. Because the atmosphere, you can't compare it. Not here, either. I mean, you get confusing. You get lost very easily. Now, the eyes are crying. Oh, no. I just remember where the last one is. Gotta go through that maze again. Ah. Hopefully, it takes us straight to it and we don't have to navigate the whole maze again because that'll be long. And I have no idea what happens after. I'm expecting a jump scare, which I'm not happy about because... I recorded the first bit of this video at 11 in the morning and now it's 9 at night and it's ah, oh, but it, that doesn't matter. Okay, thank you. I appreciate that a lot Okay A lights come on now way Now let's just make it back without screaming. Let's do our best. Big boy breaths. That was going to happen right now anyway. It's only going to be when we go past windows and stuff. So it's this way now. Yes. I reckon they're saving a big jump scare to the end of the episode, though. Yes, let's enter. Okay. Here we are. If I adjust the hand, something might happen. Yes. Oh, here we go. 
That's open again. So we've done all that just to get back. Are you serious? Okay. No, has my guy finally decided that it's time to go back to bed? Like, it's taken him a good hour. But he's like, no, okay. I'm done with this shit now. Uh, which way was it? I think we came in... Through... This way, I want to say. Yes, okay. Let's go upstairs. All the way back up. All the way back up. I don't like how long that's taken. Yes. Okay. Forget the fact that someone locked us down there. So they're probably around here. Let's go back into our room. Who's going to be in here? Oh, no one. I took my medicine before I went to bed. Wait, are we going to find out that this wasn't a hallucination the whole time? What the? Hey! Oh no. What the? I'm so concerned right now. That guy's still there. That's locked. Is this locked? That's not locked anymore, I don't think. Someone's trying to communicate with me. Sorry, mate. I was expecting that one. After all that. Oh, wait, what the? No! No, no! What the fuck? That. <laughs> I expected something like eyes or a hand or something, but when the body just appeared there, oh, that was like I said, I've been editing it. I'm not sure how the atmosphere comes across, but that, <laughs> oh, yeah, I really don't get scared of games as much anymore compared to what I used to. It's like nothing. So the fact that that got to me on such a level means I've got to play the next two episodes. Uh, I hope you guys have enjoyed that. That was... <laughs> not what I was expecting. I expect just to kind of make fun of it. You know, indie game. Ooh, 40 pence game. Let's roast it. No, that was actually really good. I'm surprised it's so cheap. I definitely recommend going and... You know, obviously they're not sponsoring me. <laughs> but... That was an incredible atmospheric experience and um you know I don't know if it was a halluc because it's all set up to be a hallucination or a dream but I'm starting to think that it's not when I first started I thought okay it's a rehab center they're giving him drugs um to give him hallucinations to scare him out of ever taking a drug again but now I'm thinking it might actually be something deeper than that which is because you know, it's not called a nightmare, it's called the mare, as in the living nightmare. I don't know. We'll have to find out in the next two episodes. But that was... That was incredible. Uh, next time I will do it all in one go, because obviously that atmosphere built up, and then it dropped over nine hours, and then it came back. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed that. I'll probably do it one episode every two weeks. Sound good? Alright, enjoy the rest of your day. Thank you for watching.